Right outside our back door lives one of the most vicious predators in Alaska. Fortunately, it's only about 15 inches long. An ermine is what you get when you mix needle-sharp teeth, silky smooth fur, and all the fury of a wolverine. They're super well camouflaged, so they could easily disappear in the winter if they wanted to. But often, I'll see them right on the side of the trail, as if they're daring you to pass into their territory. Today I'm hoping to see a few, so I can sketch a transition they make. I saw some of their tracks, but I couldn't spot any of their cute little murderous faces. So I started sketching without them. Just like the ptarmigan and the snowshoe hare, the ermines have a bright, thick, white winter coat on right now. Completely white, with a black tail, ermines will transition all the way to a chestnut color by this summer. I'd always thought this change is triggered by snow, but it actually happens because of the light. When the spring sun starts to hit the forest floor, the process of changing begins. This tenacious white menace transforms. I mean, it's still tenacious and a menace, but now it's brown. But still just as fierce, adaptive, and well-dressed as ever. 